Orlando I'm Paul Porter, arena voice of your Orlando Magic. And you'll hear me call games on NBA 2K22. Magic fans, here are your Orlando I've always wanted to be part of a video game. I've done many things, including all-star games, championship games, but I've always said I'd like to be on a video game and maybe leave my mark long after I'm gone and was very excited when I got the call from NBA 2K. At center, 7-1 from LSU, number 32, Shaquille. Jack is one of my all-time favorites with the Magic. Extremely intelligent guy. Just a great guy to sit down and have a conversation about life with. slam -o! You know, one of the fun things that I've had is Steve Kerr, who I've known for many years, had a short stint with the Orlando Magic. But whenever he comes into town with Golden State, he says, are you still doing that traveling that you did 30 years ago? And I said, well, it depends. Does your team still travel? And uh, he says, yeah, we do. And I says, yeah, then I'm doing it. Traveling. The one game they went to like mid fourth quarter before they had a traveling violation. And of course we built it up real big. And he just looked at me and shook his head and walked back to the bench. Magic fans are, I don't want to say low key, but they pick their times to cheer. They know when the game's on the line. They know when it's time to get loud. Oh, Anthony! What I try and consider myself is the voice of the fans. I know that fans are sitting there and they just want to relax and unwind for a couple of hours. So I become their voice. The fans are the reason that I'm there. If there was no public to address, you wouldn't need a public address announcer. And I want the fans to have a good time, to be part of the atmosphere. That's what I try and keep the mindset. Yes, I'm there to dispense information, but I'm really there to be the voice of the fans and to try and verbalize how the fan is feeling and equate that to how I announce the game. Three for Chuma. Oh. 